I'm Chrissy Holmes sitting here with St. John's Mayor Danny Breen for a look back at one of the most challenging years in our recent history. Mayor Breen, thank you so much for joining us. My goodness, it has been such an intense year. What has it been like for you to lead throughout 2020? I find it sometimes hard to, to find the right words to describe how 2020 has been. Uh, if you look back, we, we began with Snowmageddon in, in January, uh, went through uh, an eight-day state of emergency, which uh, was unheard of at, at that point. Um, and then we're just in recovery from that when, uh, when uh, the pandemic hit and uh, brought us to where we are today. A couple of things that did uh, happen to us is we knew once you start closing things down, Opening them up is the challenging part. And to, to say it's easy to close things, uh, to get things back open again, it's a real challenge. And that's where we see where, where we are right now. Well, there are so many things. And even if I was just to think back to Snowmageddon, that moment where um, there started to be questions about food, about how people could access supplies. And you had some tough decisions to make. What, I mean, what was going on in your world at that time? Yeah, you know, everything was, uh, was, uh, was a discussion and we, we had to try to address the needs of, of people who, uh, to make sure that after a couple of days that they were able to get food supplies, they were able to get prescriptions, uh, they were able to get other necessary items. And the challenges of doing that, and I remember when we opened up the uh, grocery stores uh, for, for a limited time to allow people to get to the grocery store, one of the big um, concerns we had, you know, so how are people going to get there? How are seniors going to get there? And, and people that need, a, that need assistance. And uh, that morning, um, Peter Gulliver uh, called me. It was about 6 o'clock in the morning. And he said, look, I'm talking to our drivers and we're going to put some cars on the road for free for today to help people get back and forth. To me, that was, uh, that just, that weight came off us right there because we really didn't know how we were going to handle that. So it uh, just showed again that the, you know, the, uh, uh, the, the people of St. John's, people of Newfoundland and Labrador always step up when, there, when there's a need and uh, uh, those, uh, those companies showed it that day for us. If you were to open up your book of ideas, Mayor Breen, and show us what kinds of stuff you got written down there and ideas and for revenue generators in the future, what, what's, in, what's in there? What, what are your big ideas for the future? Well, I think just for St. John's, uh, uh, just to focus on St. John's for a minute, I think we need to get more people living and, and participating downtown. Uh, you saw the, the benefit of the pedestrian mall this year and, and the difference that that made. Uh, we also have to support the, the tech industry. I think the startups are going to become very important here as we search for a new Verifin, which was just a great success story and, and I think is a real boost for the, um, for the economy. Um, so getting more people uh, living in the downtown area, uh, creating uh, that, uh, that hub uh, in the downtown is an important, uh, important message. It's also important that we're competitive uh, today you know we're not um, we're not competing with St. John's with with Mount Pearl Paradise and and Erna Region. We're competing with Halifax and Aberdeen and Stavanger. That's that's where our competition is. We need to all work together so we can uh, so we can take on that bigger part of our uh, global economy and uh, and use uh, use where we are as an advantage. So with all that, 2021 looks like it's going to be a challenging year. It's also an election year. What is your intention, Mayor Breen? Will you be running again? Oh yes, I'll be running again. I, I've thoroughly enjoyed uh, being mayor for the past uh, four years, and I'm uh, I'm looking forward to the election. I'm, uh, I love uh, elections. I love getting out and and even more uh, and meeting people. I don't know how that's going to look this year, but uh, but I'll certainly be uh, looking forward to the challenge. Mayor Breen, thank you so much for your time and happy New Year. Thank you, Chrissy.